Hey you two, Rune is 1-8. Now this video that I'm getting ready to do is going to be a, a do-it-yourself video and I'm going to show you guys how to depot your lipsticks to, you know, make it more convenient for you. Now I know you guys have probably seen these videos plaster all over YouTube and, you know, wherever else you've seen them, but I wanted to just come on and do my video to show guys who haven't you know seen everybody else's video so what you will need you guys is a lighter and I actually purchased this from Dollar General for like 80 cent just you know a little cheap lighter I don't smoke so you know I just have to go out and purchase something that can be used you know for a few times or whatever so this was 80 cent at my local Dollar General you also can use your lipsticks, of course. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do I think I'm going to do one. It depends on my time. I might do more. But I'm going to use just this little, you know, cheap LA Colors lipstick that I have. I have a few more. And what you also need a little pill organizer and I'm upset because I went to Dollar Tree and I only went to one I should have went to some more you guys but I really didn't feel like it but this was the only one that they had and I was upset because I wanted the the longer ones so that you guys will be able to see you know more clearly or whatever but I guess this will have to do for now so however it did you guys know it had the days Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday through Sunday going around on here. What I did was I took a be sure I don't cut myself again. Like I showed you guys in the last video, I did cut myself using the damn razor. But take one of these razors and you can get these. I got them in a pack. And I think it was like six in a pack for like two dollars and my local beauty supply. And what I did was I took it and I just went across and scraped it off, scraped off the days of the week, and what you could do is, if the lipsticks have a a seal, a cover, let me show you guys what I'm talking about, because on the LA Colors one, it doesn't have a sticker, or does it? Yeah, but it's a little cheap one, so... I don't know how it was on a hold. And I don't even think that's the right name for it. So, Okay, let me show you guys with something else. Okay, here's one of my Revlon lipsticks. You guys see the seal at the bottom where it tells you the name of the lipstick. You will take that off and insert it on here. So you'll know which lipstick is which. Now, for the fun part. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use one of these little applicator things. You guys, I know you've seen them a lot. We hardly ever use them. They always come with our eyeshadow palettes. I'm going to peel that off and use the stick part so that I can chop off the lipstick onto my other utensil that I will use. Just spoon. Here's a spoon, guys. Take the top off, of course. I'm going to roll the lipstick up. You see, it's not really that much left on the tube. And you're going to just take your stick and you're going to peel the lipstick <coughs> off onto the spoon. Excuse me. I'm doing this with. <coughs> okay. I'm coming you guys I'm trying to get all of the lipstick out especially deep down in here okay uh, probably looks slow <laughs> Ooh. okay you guys alright so Here's the empty lipstick thing. I want to set that aside. And this is what it should look like 
on your spoon. I don't want to spill it. Next, I'm going to take my lighter. And I'm going to be careful not to burn yourself, you guys. I strongly do not advise anyone under the age of 16 to do this by their by themselves. I'm just going to hold the fire under the lipstick so that it melts. It's melting, you guys. Slowly but surely. <laughs> and as it melts, you guys will see it moving around on your spoon because it's melting. Just a few more. Just a little bit more. And I won't be able to show you guys the finished pro product because this is my, you know, first time showing it. So, I will also do another video, uh, an update, showing you guys the final product. And if you guys would like, if you, you know, choose to do this video on your own, I would love for you guys to do a video so I can see it. To see how you did it. I know some people, some people use different things. Like some people do it a completely different way. I know some people microwave it. Um, there's like so many ways you could do it. Some people hold it over a stove. So just you know, this is very. It's different ways you guys can do this. So if you guys do a video, be sure to let me know because I would love to see it. It's almost done, you guys. It's really liquidy. It's just like a piece in the middle that needs to melt. <laughs> it looks so cute. It's all shiny and sparkly. And, y'all, I actually went to... I'm crazy because I went to Joanne Fabrics looking for the individual containers so that I can have like the little lip balm containers to put it in. Yeah, when I say they are crazy for their prices, like the packages that they had wasn't even like what I was looking for, the container size was like some little small like lip balm containers. They probably had like six of them in a container package plus like 20 other ones that was like way bigger. I'm like, I have no use for these, so I'm not getting ready to spend ten, twenty dollars on something I'm not gonna use. So I'm sitting there thinking, like, why didn't my dumb stuff go to Dollar Tree, y'all? So hold on, you guys. It's almost done. It stinks, <laughs> and the lighter is very hot. So, um, I wish I could show you guys the final product. Well, what it looks like is a very liquidy substance. I'm not gonna like bend it because I don't want it to spill out. But I still have like a little piece that needs to melt. But unfortunately, my lighter is hot. So, okay, okay, you guys. Then. Ouch. I'm going to take my pill organizer, open up a flap, take the spoon, and you're going to pour it in there. And, let's see. You want to be sure to get all of it in there, you guys. Let me set the spoon down. But, um, and it's going to look 
like that. What you can do now, you guys, is close that up and put this in. You can put this in the refrigerator if you want to for a few hours to let it get, you know, hard substancey like and then take it out. It won't melt, you know, okay? So, this is it. And I'm going to put mine in the fridge after. I think I'm going to do a few more. And I'm going to put it in the fridge. And tomorrow when I do a video, I'm going to show you guys the final product. So, this is my little do-it-yourself tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. And I will post the giveaway video next. See you soon.